How's it going everyone? Mitch here with another main stage tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to be talking about auxiliary um, tracks and what they are, how to use them, all kinds of fun stuff inside of main stage. Woohoo! Alright, so what we can see is that I have a piano here selected for this patch and on this patch I have a reverb and delay auxiliary track. Now these auxiliary tracks are going to be available for every single patch inside of the concert. Okay, so um, we can see that on this suitcase patch we have that reverb and delay also just like on this piano. Now what we can do is say um, we can send part of our piano track to this bus one or reverb track and then part of it to our delay track. And now we can choose with this little dial how much we want to send to that auxiliary track. That auxiliary track, once something is being sent to it, will be able to play a little bit of reverb and then it sends it again right to the output so that we can hear it. Okay. And now I have two faders in, in here inside of our main view. Uh, what I can do is select one, I can map it to that reverb and map the other one to the delay. Okay. Now, what we can easily do is Command K opens up, okay, come on. Command K opens up musical typing, woohoo, so that I can play this piano. Okay, so what we can do then is select this dial that we have and test to see if that reverb actually works. So it definitely, definitely works. Now let's try the delay. Alright, and there's our delay. So what we can easily do is edit these in real time when we're playing uh, a live set. So we can, on this piano, put a little bit of reverb however much we want to and we can edit that during in a live setting. So um, we can do this for more than just reverb and delay. You can add more auxiliary tracks by coming up here and doing add and then you can add an auxiliary channel strip and this will add that auxiliary channel strip and you can obviously like I said edit it inside of any patch inside of this concert that we have going at this time alright so um, thanks for watching everyone that's all I really wanted to talk about how we can use those auxiliary tracks um, to our advantage inside of main stage so everyone thanks for watching please comment rate subscribe if you have some um, more tips or not tips uh, suggestions on uh, future main stage tutorials. I've actually kind of been building up uh, quite a library of things I need to be doing at this point. So um, I just need to start working with uh, main stage a little bit more. Um, but let me know and I will definitely try to get around to making a video over it um, and explaining it just a little bit more. So everyone, thanks for watching. This is Mitch and hopefully I will be seeing you very soon. Peace out.